Hi, this is Kurt Bennett with 4constructionpros.com. We're here with Mark Reinhardt at Smentech. And uh, you're tell, tell us a little bit about the volumetric market. It's a little bit different market than the ready mix market. You have some certain advantages? Correct, yeah. With a volumetric mixing technology, um, we can kind of do different things a little differently than with a traditional ready mix batch plant. Um, because we have pretty much a batch plant on wheels, uh, we're allowed to be able to start and stop pouring concrete at any time, be able to do multiple different mix designs, uh, be able to do different types of um, uh, different amounts of pours, whether it's a continuous pour where the truck just continuously runs and we feed it with material, or anything down to a quarter of a yard or a wheelbarrow full. Uh, all of those capabilities we have with a volumetric mixer. The big thing we want to, or that we're trying to do today, is just expose this technology to contractors, to municipalities, um, because I think a lot of the guys don't know that there's an alternative to the traditional way of producing concrete. Um, you know, you don't see volumetric mixers running around on the street every day like you do drum, typical drum trucks. Mm -hmm. So just educating the contractor base and knowing that they do have this tool available to them, and they, it, it, there is an alternative to. Uh, the cell phone call to the local plant. Now, with a volumetric mixer, you take control of that yourself, and, and, and there is an alternative, and you can you can supply concrete yourself, whether you're in the concrete business or not. If you're in the construction business, you're going to use con concrete in some form or fashion on those projects, and now you can do that. I understand there's, there's quite a bit of material savings when you, when you talk about volumetric mixers. How much did you say was wasted in the United States a year just on... It, studies have shown 5% of the concrete pour in the United States, which equates to about 22 million cubic yards, is sent back to the plant or, or not used on the project at that time. So it's either disposed of or made into to concrete blocks. Um, so it's a tremendous amount of waste that you don't experience with a volumetric mixer. We pour exactly what you need at the exact spot. So it's made, on the, it's made fresh right on the spot and you don't have to worry about quantities as much. Correct. It's in the, you know sometimes called mobile mixers because basically they, they mix at the point of consumption for concrete, and you can start and stop it as much as you want. So you only pour exactly what you need. Anderson, you can also adjust your mix a little bit on the job site to, to varying job site demands. Is that correct? Correct. Depending on say the finishing crew or the, the guys that are purchasing concrete, the customer if they want it a little wetter or, or they want it tightened up a little bit, our trucks have the ability to do that on the fly. A typical ready mix would have to potentially send a whole nother drum truck out uh, with that different slump of concrete needed. The benefits of it from an economic standpoint, from a cost, being able to reduce your material cost, the environmental perspective, the less water, less waste, less emissions, um, it, it is a complete solution. It, are volumetrics gonna be used to pour an interstate or a high rise building? Probably not. Uh, that, that's, those are the type of pours that fit traditional ready mix baths. You know, thousand yards at a time, 20 trucks, dumping as fast as possible. That's not really the fit for our trucks. It's the secondary items. It's the road repairs. It's the utility pours that they need. That's what suits our trucks. And this is not a low-tech solution. You guys also have the, the latest volumetric mixes are also electronic in design. Is that correct as well? Correct. Their C60, which we released in 2015, is a fully electronic unit. So it's a full touchscreen computer on the back integrated with AccuPore and the telematic solutions we just uh, released this past year at World of Concrete. Everything is recorded, everything is monitored. The operator basically has to push a green start button and a red stop button. So you don't have to be concerned you can meet tight job site specs of different concrete varieties as well too? Correct. Yep, we're, we're pouring for in probably every state in the United States for DOT work and some very precise uh, concrete. All can be done with these trucks. Now, the standard concrete ready mix trucks, we already talked about nine, yard, nine to ten yard capacities. What are we talking about for volumetric trucks? Uh, we, we match almost exactly with one barrel truck as well, that eight to ten yard capacity, uh, depending on where you're at and what state you're in. Now, if you're a contractor, what are some of the advantages of having your own volum volumetric truck instead of replying on the ready mix plant to supply concrete? Yeah, one of our mixers, it, it, it's, it's an alternative tool that you have in your toolbox that you can use. So our trucks basically allow you to control your concrete, control your schedule, control your costs on that project, not having to get a third party involved, not having to sub out the concrete work to somebody else. Now you have a tool that you can do all of that work yourself and take full control of that project. And it opens up other job opportunities for you as well. 
Correct. We, I, I mentioned we, we've got a lot, number of asphalt contractors uh, that are getting into the business. We are at World of Asphalt this year for the first time ever. And everyone's kind of, you know, you guys make concrete, why are you at World of Asphalt? And it was surprising to see how many people walk by and say, this is exactly what I need. I, I do roadway repairs. Yeah, I sub out the concrete work to the concrete guys, but now I can do it myself. It does open up a whole new business opportunity for contractors where they can do this work themselves and uh, even start delivering concrete themselves. Okay, and there's different solutions available because we're, we're looking at one of the ready-mix trucks, or one of the volumetric trucks, but you also have standalone units in different capacities available too for large large job site pours? Yep, so we can do a trailer option, which is typical in remote areas that where they can stockpile the materials on site, where they continuously pour. Typically will be trailers, uh, bridge deck overlays, uh, are a common trailer uh, solution as well. But we do have anything down to a three yard unit that you can put on the back of a truck, on a trailer, or stationary units that can be in a precast plant uh, to do different forms of concrete. So basically any concrete that's being produced or consumed in the market today could be made with a volumetric.